attacked out of nowhere on her subway, subway ride home. Tonight, new video could help find the suspect who slashed a woman in the face and then ran off. CBS 2's Hazel Sanchez has the new information. Police say this man in a dark jacket, red hoodie, and sweatpants is a subway slasher on the run. Investigators say the man randomly cut 71-year-old Carmen Rivera's face as she was sitting on a D train pulling into the Broadway Lafayette station at around 7 o'clock Monday morning. Rivera didn't want to show her bandaged face as she spoke with CBS 2's Valerie Castro. I take that train every morning. Had you seen him before? Or? No, no, sweetie. Can you tell us what he looked like? Somebody that I don't even know. No, because you don't stare at people in the train. This is a sketch of the attacker described as an Hispanic man, around 25 years old, 5'10, 160 pounds, with a thin to medium build, brown eyes, and black hair. Rivera said she didn't suspect any trouble before she was attacked. I guess he had a, a, a blade, a small blade. The feeling was horrible. You know, I didn't expect that. I didn't expect that to happen to my family. You know? Amelia Rivera is the victim's sister. She says Rivera, a mother of three and grandmother, makes clothing samples and didn't want her family to worry about her. So initially, she told them she cut her face on the job. That's her natural. That's her natural. That's the way she is. That's the way she is. I said, hey, get angry at her. What's the matter with you? Wake up! Rivera needed 30 stitches to close the four inch cut on her left cheek. She didn't let the frightening assault stop her from getting on a train again and going back to work today. I'm going to work. That's going to stop me. <laughs> I said, You're crazy. I leave his problem to God because he's got an answer to God for everything that he's done. Rivera says she wants to speak with her attacker once he's caught to show and tell him how his actions have affected her and hopes he won't hurt anyone else again. In Borough Park, Brooklyn, Hazel Sanchez, CBS 2 News. Rivera also says that police have told her they know who her attacker is and they are anticipating a quick arrest.